animals. Maybe from Africa? Looks like Hugo played with them. Hope he didn't break anything. It was so good to herbs and unguins. The one she gave to Hugo worked well. I hope he's feeling better. Smell. Incense. That's amazing. Mm. The Mediterranean Sea. The Kuna should be somewhere here. This one? Or this one? Necklaces? Rings? Quite the elegant lady. a nice bed. Our captain has good taste. Hey. It must be great to pilot this thing. It's worth all the other troubles. Come on. Take it. Oh, uh, <laughs> go on. You won't crash into anything. <sighs> so? It's amazing. It's the sea you feel. It's freedom. Thank you for taking us. Thank God, no. I'm usually not so kind. Oh. He's a bastard, I know. He has reasons to be deep scars. Not that it excuses- Amicia! Amicia! Oh, duty calls. I'm sorry. You're welcome. Thank you. Amicia, come! Look! There's something there! That's it! Lacuna! It's exactly like in my dreams! Thank you! Whatever's there, we'll find it together. Island explorers. Yes! You know, it's not important if I die. What? What are you talking about? The Magister Vaudan told me I'm going to die. God, no, Hugo, I'm so sorry. It won't happen. Don't be sad. I'm happy to be here. This boat is the best, and I like Sophia and Anna, even if you don't like him. Sorry. Just wanted to say we'll be preparing to make land soon. I'll need your help. Just come see me when you're ready. Yes, sure. I'm happy to be here with you. down here. Oh yes, that's our nose. Can't believe I heard him snore through the storm. Books. Pretty rare. She must have travelled a lot to get all these. And now she'll probably sell them illegally.
I'll stay. I'll fix a few things here and I'll join you later. Fine. We'll take a tour while it's still light and find a place to sleep. Sounds good. By the way, this land is under the Count's law. Be nice. See? I see. Thank you. Looks like we have a new king. Good King Hugo. That's right. During the brighter days, all children are kings. Just like the child of Embers who watches over our island. Your presence is a blessing because you are the future. Just like him. For he'll deliver all of us from the darkness. Please. Enjoy the festivities. Thank you. Goodbye. Well, that's a pretty good start, no? I wonder what the church would think of this. They seem successful. Pray that we're successful. Well, come on, your majesty. <laughs> I've seen. It's very beautiful, yes. But now we need to find whatever called you here. Welcome! The market is just up the street. Plenty for you to see. Let's go! Quick! Yes. Hey, wait, wait. So, I heard of this dream and, well, I'd like to help. But first, I must know what you're searching for. All right. So it's... Uh, it's a bit strange, but... Well... Go on, Hugo. Yes. In my dream, I woke up on the beach, and I was sick and scared. But a big bird came, and I followed him. I thought I was dying, but the bird showed me water that healed me. And there was a huge tree, too. And that's where I wake up each time. Good. So, bird, tree, and water. <laughs> Could be anywhere. But I guess it's a start. We can ask at the market. Come on. Oh, it's amazing! So many colors and perfumes. Amicia, can we ask people about my dream? Uh, you shouldn't Hello, tell sir. them that it's a dream. Uh, and do don't ask too many Maybe people. Spices? You never know. Maybe later. We've been told of a pond of water with healing properties. Do you know where it is? Not a clue. But there are many ways to be blessed during the brighter days. Oh, good to know. Is there a big bird on this island? <laughs> There's a few here and there. Maybe you'll see them. Well, thank you for your time. You're welcome. No pond. Maybe birds. <laughs> yes! Straight from our mother's garden. Perfect for the festivities. Hello. Hello there. Would you know of a beach where we could find special birds? <laughs> this is an island, so the birds are mostly seagulls. Not a bird much dreamed of, I'd wager. <laughs> They're bloody thieves, I tell you. It's not a seagull. Let's go. Hey. Thank you, sir. May your day be bright. <laughs> Yours too. He knows nothing. <laughs> well, he knows about seagulls. Be patient, Hugo. Hello, sir. Would you... Is there a magic pond here? With birds and trees? <sighs> <laughs> I'm not from here, you know. I just come for the market. Maybe you have a bird? No. <laughs> well, thank you, sir. <laughs> Anytime. You're about as subtle as you are tall. What? Let's see the rest. Those reports ready. Who wants some? Bright fabric. Perfect to wear for the brighter days. Can't 
we pass so it keeps on going the village stretches all the way up we'll have to see it all then what's over there goats you want to say hello is she nice of course she is What's she called? Lucinda. You're a nice goat, Lucinda. She loves you. Really? <laughs> there. That's I love you in goat. <laughs> you all right? She screamed at me. That's called bleating. It's how they talk. She's a goat, you know. That's what they do. But it's not nice. <laughs> you were scared, that's all. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Any time. Goodbye. I must say, she startled me a bit, too. That would actually be a good way to disorientate an enemy. <laughs> Can't wait to hear you bleat into battle. <laughs> Next time, maybe. <laughs> Did you know goats don't have front teeth? Just like some of my men. someone here good work with the decorations everyone oh and if you still want to help we need a hand with tonight's feast good afternoon hello we've just arrived and we heard about a beach with a pond not too far hmm that's very specific anyone sorry I really don't know me neither there's also a big tree well, we have lots of big trees. You'll find some up on the plateau. Thank you anyway. Of course. Why don't they know? Dreams are tales of the soul, Pipsqueak. Not of this world. We'll ask again. Dancers and musicians are now in place. The festivities are about to begin. Come. Ha! <laughs> Can't wait to see that. Let's go. Oh, Alicia, can we go too? Sure. Sounds nice. Should we be worried about the Count's army here? They look pretty quiet. Mm, different captain, different men, different land. Don't think so. Good. I hope there will be a dragon man. And I'd like to see a dragon man too. All this wasn't in my dream, but I love this place. It's all so dreamlike, yes. Islands can be nice little havens, but they're fragile ones. Oh, don't get gloomy. Chance! They're here. They must be about to start. Please, stick to the rhythm, all right, Lucy? No improvisation. I sing for the Child of Embers, and he needs energy! But not that much. All right, focus, please. We're going soon. Hurry up! Last year was so grand. You, you think they'll do better? I know they've been rehearsing for months. I hope they'll cross the main square once again. It's the best moment. Anyway. A local deity, obviously. It's St. John's book on the continent. The summer solstice. So it's probably all about fertility and prosperity. Is he magical? He's a god. Pagan one. A peaceful one. Yes. Dances! We see dances! 
<laughs> I see that. You know how to dance this, Anna? <laughs> Do I look like it? Oh, you never know. I'd like to see you dance. <laughs> You're 30 years too late, lad. I'll imagine it then. The walk of devotion has begun. The procession is coming. Let me see you quick. She should have been here already. Um, sorry, sire. All right. Yes. You all know me. I'm not a man of words. Emily, your priestess, she will be here soon. She will open these brighter days with her beautiful words. The words of a mother. The mother of the child of embers. The child who protects what? his sacred land. It's him. From Come. the rats of disease and war. The rats? No, wait. Hey, what are you doing? Oh. It's because it's the Count Amicia. We had a deal. Called your rats. Wait, what? That was your deal? You saved me so he would murder the Count for you? You survived. That comes with a price. No. You don't take advantage of a child and call it a deal, Anna. We came all this way for him. You won't ruin that. Fuck it. I don't need you. No. Oh, no. I knew it. I won't miss this time. I'll take care of him. Catch the girl. No. No. This is not our fight. Run. <laughs> People, Hugo. Nothing ever stays nice. It always turns bad. Always. Why? We're going back. It's too late. No. Things aren't always nice, but you can change them. How? The way we always do. We fight. We stop Arno before he does more damage. We save your dream. We need a way back, a discreet one if possible. What if Arno is dead? Or he killed the Count? We'll improvise, remember. We're good at this. We bloody are. There has to be something. All right, let's get to work. Let's 
I should be right behind it. Locked, of course. Look, up there. We could climb and pass above the door. Yet. Oh, it's too high. Let's find something to climb up. Yes. Hugo. I think that's a car behind. Here. Let's get that cart in place. Up and over. Together. By the way, why did Arno attack the Count? He said that... It's because of the count that his shield is broken. Come on. Up. Climb up. Yes. Good. Now, careful. Hurry! The count's being attacked! Go! I'll keep watch for the others. Let's try to follow them. inside.
Listen. Sword noises. Yes, yes, quick. They're here. The Count's alive. Can you stop him? Shut up! I'll kill you like I killed your men! You'll die anyway. What do we do? Of course, my love. I'll kill you, bitch, Count! I'll teach you what it is to lose what you care for! You've always been a disgrace to the knighthood, Arno. And you've been a pain in my ass for too Are you long. all right? Lock him up! I'll handle that later. So where do you know this beast from? We shared a boat and had time to chat on the way, but I didn't know he was after you, sire. Now, if you're not bandits, who are you? Amicia, and this is Hugo, my brother. He's a bit afraid. Well, don't be. There was more fright than danger. These days are dedicated to life and peace. Would you agree to be our guests for dinner? Are you sure? I mean... Sure. Emily's right. You helped, you deserve it. Come with us. Hugo, come. So, how do you like our terrace? This is really your house. <laughs> this is home. It's incredible. Come, come inside. Oh, it's big. It is, and it's only a small part of the palace. Oh, do you fancy some dates before we show you to your room? Dates? What is it? A fruit, Hugo. Can I? Come on. Sure, Your Grace. Please go easy, Hugo. Yes. I know this all looks pretty formal, but please, here I'm not Your Grace. I am the mother. I am myself, so be yourself. Yes. During the brighter days, all the people of Lacuna are one, united around the child so? members. I love it! Ha <laughs> ha! A bon vivant. Be careful, they're very rich. So where are you from? Guyenne. We fled the war and the plague. We came here hoping for a better life. And we heard of this island. You were right to come here. Let's keep going. You must be tired after this adventure. It's amazing. I know. Can't wait to see our room. Agnes? Go get a room ready for two, please. Certainly, Mother. She's her mummy. No, it's symbolic. And these are our gardens. My favorite part. Splendid. Finally, they clean to the basins. Yes, aren't they nice? You're quite young for such a long trip. Where are your parents? Mummy is somewhere, but Dad was killed. By who? How? Uh, Hugo. Victor, don't be so... Military. <laughs> you know me. Come next to me, Hugo. Yes. You see those plants? Most of them are not from here, but we managed to make them grow anyway. And they look great. Thanks to a lot of love and care. We are just like them, you know. We drink water. <laughs> and we need a good soil, love and care. This land is open to you, if you wish to keep growing here. But of course, the big sister will decide. Right, Amicia? Thank you so much. Those were kind and true words. Let me show you something else. Victor? Of course, Come, my Hugo. The land here is strong. The child of embers breathes life into it. We created the brighter days to celebrate him. In the hope he'll come back to us. 
as it is foretold. To us, his mother and father. And to the people, we pray to him, not as a god, but as our long sleeping child. We love and revere him to revive his flame. You can do it in your own way. Sure. Hugo? I'll pray to the bird. A humble flame to light his night. And may he rise, a sun, a sun, so bright. So bright. So bright. Thank you. I appreciate it. Shall we go? Uh, sorry, Mother. Could we take some time to pray for our father? Hugo? Yes, of course. I understand. I'll wait for you. Come when it is done. Dear father. Hugo, is it really your bird? Take a good look at it. Oh, yes. I feel it. It has the same beak. And I just know it. Good. Very good. Let's go back to them. And no words about that to anybody here, right? It's our secret. Is everything ready for tomorrow? Yes. The new robes look wonderful. It will be perfect. Excuse me. Oh. Shall we go? Sure. I must say, we appreciate that you paid homage to the child so willingly. Every child bears the future of the world. One child can change everything. That is very true. Here it is. Go on. This is too much. Nonsense. You're our guests. There's a good dinner being cooked. A real dinner, Amicia! Shh! Oh, we'll need to get you some new clothes. It looks like you had a long journey. Are you going to kill Arno? Hugo! He will be judged. All those who do bad things are. And he did a lot. But you will have the chance to testify if you wish to do so. But enough of that. We'll leave you to rest. Tomorrow, feel free to enjoy Lacuna. Brighter days are the best time for it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> My lady. Beds are great. Try jumping on them. Yes! <laughs> These clothes feel so nice. Yes. Hey, come here, sleepyhead. <sighs> come on, it's just the sun. Look, it's worth it. Whoa! It's... Well, it's... Like a dream? Yes, exactly like my dream. Quickly, let's eat something and get going. Come on. Beautiful! Can we go play? Hey, we're here to know why you dreamt about this place, right? Yes! Let's go! 